Hey peeps, today I'll be playing Super Mario RPG. I've been looking forward to this for a very long time. Ever since I started Retro Game Night, I knew that at one point I wanted to do this game. I'm gonna let the opening uh, demo scene play out here. Now this game came out in 1996, I believe, or 1995. I think it just said earlier, but I didn't catch it. Of course, Mario has to be called Super Mario. It won't settle for just Mario. So long before we had Paper Mario, or uh, the Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga, Nintendo actually teamed up with Squaresoft known for the Final Fantasy series and for most of the best role-playing games that came out on the Super Nintendo back in the day. And they had Squaresoft work on this game, Super Mario RPG. I still think this is probably the best Mario RPG game that was ever made, and it was the very first one. And it has its own set of unique characters, like right here we have Mallow. And unfortunately, we've never seen Mallow in another Mario or Mario RPG game since. It's like a little marshmallow. And this game is a very uh, beginner-friendly role-playing game, kind of like Pokemon. Ah. This scene is actually not in the actual game. There's Gino. If any of you guys have heard about how uh, a lot of people want Geno in Smash for the DLC, it's because of this game right here. On memories of Mario RPG and Geno. I don't know why there isn't as much of a demand for Mallow. There is a Me Fighter costume for Mallow, so that confirms that he won't come out on Smash. And of course there's Bowser. Another fun twist in this game is how Bowser, actually Keen Bowser, pardon me, Keen Bowser, uh, Bowser actually becomes one of your party members, so he's actually a good guy in this game, which is a very interesting twist. There's Birdo. I love this game so much. It's been a while, a very long while since I've played it. It plays just like a Final Fantasy game, except Mario RPG had some like timing elements where you have to press uh, the button at the right moment to do more damage or to defend yourself and take less damage. And that mechanic uh, has carried over to all the other role-playing games for Mario, whether it be Paper Mario and all of its sequels or the Mario Luigi games. This demo right here gives you a very good overview of what you what you can expect to see throughout the whole game. And there's Peach. <laughs> she cries a lot, but you can actually use her in the game too, which is cool. Ah. That's gonna say Super Mario RPG, Legend of the Sun Stars. So 1996, that's when it came out. It's also the year the Nintendo 64 came out. So this game came out at the very end of the Super Nintendo life cycle. Right, whoops. Oh yeah, I need to uh, make a new game file here. Let's call it Shad. I forgot what I used to call my save files. Oh well. Now the game starts off in the typical Mario fashion with Bowser coming over to kidnap Peach as always. But then uh, a lot of 
uh, ironic twists play out. Yeah. So the very beginning of the game seems to resemble a typical Mario game. You go to Bowser's Castle. Well, in this game, Bowser's Castle is the first level, not the last. Alright. So the gameplay is like this, where you have this, you know, map. You can avoid enemies if you want, if you don't want to fight them. And eventually you fight them. Ah. Uh. Ooh, I still got the timing down. When Mario ducks like that, that means he's defending. Ah, I still got it. Ow! Okay, I missed that one. If you get it perfectly, you can even take zero damage. And of course, uh, you have HP... And instead of uh, MP, you have, I believe it's called Flower Points, FP, to use special attacks. Uh-oh, can't go back that way. And yes, there's Bowser, already. Already time for the showdown. Oh, Bowser's laugh in this game. Don't let Bowser bruise you, Mario. Mario, prepare yourself for the great beyond. Wow, that sounds like a death threat. Oh yeah. I'm supposed to attack the... Pink Link. <gasps> This'll make the chandelier fall. Mario, the chain. Aim for the chain. If you only attack Bowser, then eventually you're going to run out of health and lose. The thing is that Peach gives you those hints. Two jump attacks and that's all it takes. What was that sound? A kinkling is supposed to be a chomp, but it looks kind of like a skull. It's very creepy. No, it's a chain reaction. Aha, uh -huh, puns. Hey now, kinkling. Yeah. Coming Mario? That was a hammer. That's a nice throwback to the original Mario game. When Bowser threw hammers. Fight Mario, fight. This should finish you. Mario keeps doing the peace sign too early. Don't declare victory too early. Wahaha, did you think I was just gonna give her to ya? You're always in my way. This is it. I'm gonna take you out, Mario. Aha. Unga foiled again. Poor Bowser. He can never beat Mario. Except at the very beginning of Mario Odyssey. Oh, Mario. You had me so worried. Let's get out of here. Shriek, Mario. I'm going to fall. I think we're all gonna fall. a star in the clouds. It broke into seven pieces. And you have this ginormous sword. That's the real villain of this game. I forgot its name. I think it's called Mac. M-A-C. Yeah, that's the main villain of this game. This giant sword. You find out toward the end of the game that that giant sword is actually kind of like a spaceship. So the real enemy is inside that sword. Oh wow, Mario got sent so far. Well, he got sent back to his house, so... There's Toad. Down the pipe. Of course his chimney is a pipe. Oh, I just realized something. The Lego Mario, uh, Mario's house for Lego Mario looks very similar to this house. Hey Mario, lots of people use something called a door to go in and out of their houses. 
Anyways, I came by to pick up Toadstool sh since she's a bit late. <laughs> the writing and the story for this game is actually pretty good. Uh, I miss the days when Square Soft, now it's known as Square Enix, ever since they merged. But there was a day when Square Soft made the best role-playing games and knew how to make games with amazing stories uh, back in the day. Oh well. This was such an interesting partnership between Square Soft and Nintendo. They've always had a close working relationship, though. Alright, Toad says, Hey, I thought the princess was here with you, Mario. So where is she? Mario, what's with the sound treatment? You're not telling me something. It's Bowser again, isn't it? Well, actually, Mario doesn't talk in this game. He's a sound protagonist. It's Bowser again, isn't it? Oh no, here we go again. Mario, would you please bring her back like you always do? Yeah, sure. Oh, uh, if you're tired? Yeah, okay. Let me save real quick. So, we're going to try to go back to Bowser's castle. Haha, <laughs> Mars freaking out at this giant sword. Oh, who goes there? A trespasser. This castle now belongs to us, the Smithy Gate. Oh, Smithy. That's his name. Not Mac. Why did I think Mac? I think there's a different enemy called Mac. Smithy, Smithy. It's our first step towards uh, taking over this world. And if it weren't for nosy characters like you, we'd practically own this world. So let's, uh, let's see you deal with this. So now the bridge is gone. So essentially we have to go all the way across the world to approach the castle from the other side. It'll be a long journey. Alright, first we gotta tell Toad about what happened. Where's Toad? Why is he in my house? You're back so soon, did you forget something? No, what happened then? Bridge to Bowser's Keep is out now? Just wonderful. You must inform the Chancellor of Mushroom Kingdom at once. Let's go, Mario. Alright, let's go. Oh. Oops, excuse me. Oh, that bump on your head reduced your HP level. One of the Mushroom Kingdom's famous items ought to perk you right up. Receive the mushroom. Those are basically healing items in this game. You know how to use them? Yes, I do. Okay, I see. You're just so so well traveled and well experienced, Mario. Uh, now why did I rush back? I had something to tell you. Ak, I remember. I came to warn you that Mushroom Way is so many with monsters. I just barely made it back here in one piece. Mario, please do something. Perhaps I can help. Do you know about time tits? Yep, I do. Hey, you better watch out. He knows about time tits. He's gonna punch your lights out. If you say no, you basically get this tutorial. He's got more bark than bite, huh? And now, why did I rush back? I had something to tell you. That's right, we need to tell the Chancellor about Toadstool. I'll see you over at Mushroom Kingdom. Just in case, take these with you. Why, thank you. Okay. I'm gonna skip most of these battles. When I used to play this game as a kid, well, or try to skip the battles. Ah, uh, so nostalgic. When I used to play this game as a kid, I would like clear out every area, defeat every enemy. When I try to challenge myself and try to beat the game at a lower level. Because for an, an RPG, this game is pretty easy. It's very accessible. Uh, yeah, you can gamble too. Whoa. Save Toad here.
if you grind and level up a lot, just like in any role-playing game, uh, it, it's a lot easier. Well, coins. It probably will be smart to level up a bit. Uh, let me see how far I can get. I think there's a save point somewhere. Um, where's my health? What's my health? Okay. Let me try and save Toad up here. Oops. Get rid of this guy. So yeah, this game is pretty similar to Chrono Trigger, which is like one of the best role-playing games ever made, if not the best. My health is not looking so great right now. The music in this game is actually very good as well. Oh, that mushroom healed my health, so I should be good to go. I want a save point though. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna go find a save point, or go back to the old save point. Okay, I'm back. I actually did a few more battles to gain level 2, because I know that there's a boss coming up. And when I've played this game for the very first time, it actually took me a while to get past even the very first boss. Since I was so new to the game. Hey, are you looking at me? My hammer and I don't like you. Well, that's not very nice. Mario, you better be careful. He's definitely got a mean streak. This is a hammer brother. Green spec. Bad memories of Mario games. Hammer brothers are always such a pain. Now you got my hammer angry. You shouldn't have done that. I used to think there was a way to like sneak past him without pissing hop, pissing him off. Oh well. And there's two of them, of course. Hammer brothers. All right, let me try and kill the first one as fast as I can. Two on one. Whoa. I hate this move. Hammer time. Oh wow. It's hard to get the timing to block that. Alright. It only needs two jumps? Well, why did I struggle with this as a kid? Hmm. Also, I could use items. Maybe I didn't know how to use items when I was a kid. When the bosses use Valor up, that means uh, they can take more damage. Alright, this will- alright. This might take a while. Should be fine though. So yeah, with any- oh, that's it. Wow, okay. I must have been pretty dumb as a kid. I struggled with that boss. Thanks Mario. I was running so fast I wasn't watching where I was going. Mushroom Kingdom's just ahead. We're almost there Mario. Hey, where does Hammer come from? Well, from the Hammer Brothers, of course. Hey, do you know what this is? Well, yeah, it's a hammer. It's the Hammer Bros insignia on it. No one stands a chance against you when you want them with this. You never know, it might come in handy. Picked up a hammer. And of course, you can equip it. You get a lot of different weapons throughout the game. Alright. Now we're in the Mushroom Kingdom. Ah. Uh, oh, this guy. Go and save here. There's actually a secret chest. Um, I need to make sure I get it. A lot of people don't know about this. If you miss that chest in this part of the game, you'll never be able to get it again.
Sir, Mario has arrived. But here's the Chancellor. Mario, thank goodness you're here. We heard an explosion or something at Bowser's Keep. It was so loud, I almost dropped my spores. Wow. Oh, excuse me? Well, where's the princess? She departed for your house hours ago. I fear the worst. Could Bowser somehow be behind all of this? This is like Mario, like, pantomiming. Oh yeah. Mario can... transform into other characters and pantomime. Spores alive. You're telling us that Bowser has abducted the princess again? Never mind, it'll be up to you to enter the keep and rescue Princess Toadstool. Already tried. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I love this game. Egad, the keep is unassailable? What awful power is at work here? Mario, her life is in your hands. Please save our dear princess. Yeah, I'll go I'll go save her. Ah. I almost forgot. This may not help you, but why don't you take it along? Actually that will be quite helpful. Mario! Oh. Okay. Forgive me, but I can't stop worrying about the princess. Go to the cell and prepare for your journey. The Vault Guard shall assist you. Okay. Let's see, do you have anything else to say? All we can do is wait here, don't let us down. Wow. Useless. So on Mario, good luck. We know we don't let us down. These toads, these mushroom people, they're so useless. I think the cellar is... wait. Oh, this is Peach's room. Cellar is this way? Yeah. Mario, the chance is filming in. Come on, let me show you around. Yay, treasures. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Let's see what's in here. There's Mallow. <laughs> Mallow can't jump very well. Come back here! Oh, poor Mallow. Aww. Aww. Poor Mallow. Oh no, that reptile stole my grandpa's coin. Boo hoo, sniffle. I can't cry, big boys don't cry. But it's just not fair. What am I gonna do? Wow! Oh! Yep. Rain or shine, I shall fulfill my duty. Yeah. Anytime Mel cries, it causes a rainstorm. Mm. That crocodile has no shame. Yeah, yes? Gee, you're soaking wet, aren't you? Wow, he can just turn it off. I'm alright now, sorry, there's nothing like a good cry. But why was I crying? Wow. There was some reason. <laughs> wow. My grandpa asked me to buy some things from here. When I walked into town, that croc stopped me. Oh yeah, he took it from me. He stole my coin. I chased him, but he's way too fast. Mario, let's see how you're going to take care of Bowser. Wow, he doesn't stand a chance. Wow, you're THE Mario? I know about you. You've got more jump in you than a box of frogs. I'm Mal from Tadpole Pond. I'm a frog. Is he? Is he really? Uh, but can you believe it? I can't jump. Embarrassing, huh? How about it, Mario? Will you help me catch that filthy thief? Sure thing. If you say I'm a little busy... Oh, great. Uh, hang on. Let me fix the... Again, the camera's blocking the text box. Like in every video, I have to move my camera to another spot. Uh, sure thing. 
If you say I'm a little busy, then Malastat st starts crying again. Alright, so... The young frog, Malo, who doesn't look at all like a frog, joins Mario in his quest. Alright. The save. I'm gonna wander around town for a bit and talk to people before moving on. I'll be right back. Hey Mao, what kept you? I was starting to worry. Wait until you hear this, you see? Wait, I've already heard. The old frog Fuchsius, that's Mao's grandfather, told me. He seems to know everything. Hold on. Listen, the truth of the matter is, well, um, the coin was stolen. What? Well, if that's the case, I guess we can't trade. What a shame. Huh. Oh, but there's no need to worry. Mario here will help us out. Is that so? Well, if Mario's on your team, you'll have that coin back in a jiffy. Not so fast. Take this with you. You'll probably need it. Nice. Pick me up will help revive a character if they die. Oh, uh, you know, I hate to admit this, but I love this job. Why do you hate to admit it? Alright, let me get a pair of shirt, a shirt, and a pair of pants. Ooh, this is good too. It's very expensive though. Hmm. I'll hold off for now. Because I think I can get a free one later. Alright, equipped my armor. Let's see what's down here. There's a secret chest here. Oh. Yeah. I think there's another one. Hmm, maybe not. Okay. Alright. I saw him. He's here somewhere. He just zoomed past me a second ago. Did you see him? Did he look something like this? How does Malo know that Mario can change his appearance? Why yes, exactly. He's the one who took my coin. Why didn't you stop him? Because I forgot my bazooka at home. Wow. Sheesh, give me a break here. Toes have bazookas? Come back here. Oh, there he is. Croco. Yarhar. Yo's mugs will never catch me. A snail could outrun you morons later. Alright, take care, man. <laughs> Mario's dizzy. That's him. Hurry, Mario. Let's get him. Yeah, let's go get him. Yeah, you do that. Alright, let's go chase down this croco fellow. I wonder if he's related to King K. Rule. There he is. He's probably stashed in his bag. Let's nab him. Are you trying to tail me? Go on home to mommy before you get hurt, kid. Okay. Alright, let's chase him. I might need to level up a bit here, but I'll do that later. Oh, I can save. Or I could try to take on the challenge of beating Croco at level 2. I don't think I've ever tried that. You couldn't jump to save your life, kid, so I guess it's goodbye. Spinny flower. Whoa. So yeah, you can choose to avoid all the enemies, but then that'll make the bosses really tough. Hang on. There we go. Oh, you're a persistent bugger, but I'm 100 miles ahead of you. I don't think he knows distance. 100 miles is, a uh, Yeah, it's a lot farther than this. Whoa. Ooh, treasure. Aha, I got it. I didn't even need it. I should have saved it. Whoops. Alright, enemy. Oh no. There's a mutant frog. It kind of looks like a ninja turtle. Ow. Ow. Ow.
curious. Kids these days would find this game hard. They might, because kids these days can't handle any amount of difficulty in their games. Oh, oh, this will be helpful. Give it up already. That treasure box is tempting, but now is not the time. I think now is the perfect time. He sucks. He can't even get it. I got it. If you defeat enemies with a star, basically you instantly get the experience that you would have gotten from that battle. Ooh. How come I'm not level 3 yet? Huh. Okay. I'll get that other chest. By the way, the composer of my RPG is Yoko Shimomura. He's a very famous composer in the video game industry. Dead end, and they won't give up. I'll just have to hide. She also composed music for Fire Emblem and Kingdom Hearts. And also Final Fantasy XV. He's gone into hiding. Let's see if we can sneak up behind him and catch him. Um... And on. I'm going to, uh, okay. Oh yeah, I remember I couldn't figure out how to do this part. What's this? You fools couldn't chase down a pumpkin. You have to sneak up from behind. Ah, what's this? You fool. okay. There we go. Ah, your eyes are much faster than your feet. At this rate, it'll take you 100 more years. Whoops. Aha. <laughs> 50 more years, okay. I think the next time I get him will be the boss fight, so I'm gonna go back and find the save point. Alright, I did a few more battles to level up to level 3. I also have a new abilities. Let's see if I can beat Croco right here. Oh, I have to redo this, okay. I think because I left the area, I have to start over. You again? This is getting old. It's, it'll still take you... Ooh. Enough. You got me fair and square. I'll give you back your coin. Oh, did you really believe I was? Lying! We're great. Let me use Fire Orb. Button mashing. Youch. Uh, wait. I should save my flower points. Ooh, that did so little damage. Okay. Now I just have to keep doing normal attacks. Ow, ow. Oh, jeez. Uh, he's a mushroom. There we go. Practice blocking. Oh, I don't think I can block this. Ow! Alright, Mario attacks. Aloe heals. Ow. Uh. I'm running out of mushrooms. Oh, he has a mushroom too? Okay. Last mushroom. 
Oh, actually, no. I have two more left. Well, now one more. Keep missing that block. Okay. Hmm. Alright. It's not looking good. Oh, I won. Okay. Just barely. Give me back my coin, or I'll belt you again. Ouch. I'm gonna pay you back in space, kids. Go on. Take back your grubby old coin. Adios, amigos. Adios. Alright, we got it back. Wow, that was really close. Yeah, we did it. We got Grandpa's coin back. I can finish my errand now. Hey, look at this. The crocodile left the wallet. You can give this back to the toad that he stole it from. You can also keep it or sell it if you want to be a terrible human being. I'm going back to the shop at Mushroom Kingdom. Are you coming? Yeah. That little trampoline will just take you right out of the area. Alright, let me save. I might need to level up before I try the next part, but uh, let's see what happens. Ah, battle. Oh, I should show Ma Malo's Thunderbolt. It's good when you have multiple enemies. Alright, time to go back to the Mushroom Kingdom. Uh-oh. What's going on here? We have new enemies. Shy guys on pogo sticks. Ah. Mao's normal attacks are so weak. Damage. Uh. Yay. Thanks, Mario. I'll continue to stand watch, but now everyone seems suspicious. Everyone is always suspicious. By the way, look what I found. Oh, I want 10 coins. Well, that's lovely. Well... Please leave the correct amount of money for the items. Well, what's to stop people from stealing? Uh... Excuse me? You want to- what? How can you shop at a time like this? Just take what you want and leave some money behind. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna save here. I'm gonna, and then I'm gonna go around saving people. Okay, I'm gonna go save people. Finished. Let's save this guy right here. That was too darn close. Thanks for your hand, Mario. Hey, that's the wall at the crocodile site from. Can I have it back? Sure, I'm a nice guy. Thank you so much. Here, I'll give you this as a reward. Go on now, take it. Power tab. You can actually sell the wallet for way more money, but I'm not gonna do that. Alright, time to go into the castle and save the people there. Let's see. Save this toad right here first.
Now that was really scary. Everyone's hiding in the princess's bedroom. I and some others couldn't escape in time. I hope no one got hurt. I'll go follow him in a moment. Whoa. All these battles are the same. Ow. Hey, Mario leveled up. You can choose which stats to increase further. Uh, I just always pick the option that has the highest gains. Thunderbolt can one shot them. That's nice. Ooh, I can get the treasures again. Never mind that. Guess what? I found it's a gold coin. A gold coin. It's all mine. Oh, I found this in a cell. Here you can have it. Okay. I guard a vault. No one takes a treasure. Well, I already did. Why is he so proud to find one gold coin? Oh. Uh, give it to Mallow. I'm too scared to pass by them. Wow. Just had to defeat one? Wow, interesting. Oh wow, I can jump on top of them. Not so fast, pal. I ain't your pal. Look at him. He can't even bounce. Maybe we could bounce on his head. I can bounce well enough. Saved by Mario again. How could I ever thank you enough? Stop being so useless. That's how you can thank me. You're in one piece. Thanks to Mario, of course. These guys would all be absolutely hopeless without Mario. Saved by Mario again. Yeah. Oh no, the Chancellor is still in the throne room. What? That's terrible. Oh, with Mario around, we're safe, right? Hmm. Here we go. Now, hey wait, hang on for a second, okay? Oh yeah, if you say the other option, I don't think you get this present right here. Uh, please take this. The princess would be happy to know you have something of hers. Alright. Good luck. Give him heck. What are those things out there anyways? Oh no. You may not sleep. Oh! Oh! She healed me! That's nice. I'm scared. A good place to save. All right, it's time for the boss. Whoa! Ah! Use my flower tabs. They increase your power points. So you can use more special attacks. Uh oh. That's a lot of enemies. Where do you think everyone went? 
Well, okay, game, looks like we have ourselves a new home. The Chancellor is up in the top corner. Oh, great. Now my camera's blocking the Chancellor. He's in the top corner. And there's no one here and who can stand in our way. Yahoo, let's bounce the night away. The camera is always blocking something, whether it's a text box or whatever. No matter where I put it, the game will find a new spot where something is blocked. Not so fast, pal. Look at him, can't even bounce. Why do they keep saying this? Hey, maybe we can bounce on his head. This is exactly what the previous guy said. Are these robots programmed to say the same lines over and over again? Whoa. This looks like a miniature version. Okay, this is why I remember that it was called Mac, because the first boss is called Mac. The Smithy is the main villain. Mac is just the first boss who looks like Smithy. Okay. Listen up, gang. These guys are gonna put a stop to our party. Are we happy about this? You're asking for it. Oh, you're gonna get it. You picked the wrong people not to bounce with, Bob. How about a fat lip to go with that ugly mustache? Wow. A lot of... Boss. A lot of boss characters, uh... You know, no, no, a lot of characters in this game make fun of Mario about his mustache. I think that's as about as- oh, that did not do very much damage. Anyways, I was saying, I think that's as, uh, as fast as you can do it. Oh, why are they still alive? Oh jeez. Max stunned. Okay. Alright, this should get rid of the shy guys. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, that wasn't too bad. One damage? Oh, six damage, okay. Looks like Mallow's defense is alright, but Mario takes quite a bit of damage. Let's see how long this takes. These battles are all about outlasting your opponent. Seems like the fire orb didn't really do that much damage. Should've just saved the fire points for Mal's Thunderbolts. Oh! Um... Let me take this time to heal. Alright, Mac- Whoa. I thought he was going to come crashing down on uh, one of my characters. Ah, he keeps using that move. Hmm. I need a honey share syrup. That recovers flower points. As all he does.
I knew they were going to come back. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll just let Malo finish everyone off. One more Thunderbolt. Yeah. Malo is better at throwing out Thunderbolts than Pikachu. So that's like the first section of the game. You have to collect these seven stars in order to restore Star Road. That will get revealed later. I'm just explaining it right now. Well, the next screen kinda, you know, makes it pretty obvious too. Right here, star pieces. Since it's been a while since I played this, now that I'm playing it again, I'm noticing that there are a lot of similarities to Earthbound. This is not good. This is not good. The mustached one is strong. Strong, yes. We must warn the boss. Come on. Aw oh, man, I should have killed these guys. Gracious. Oh, it's you, Mario. What a relief. Once again, Mario to the rescue. Always Mario to the rescue. But who were those? Chancellor. Sir, thank goodness you're alright. Mario, so it was you who got us through all of this. We owe much to you. Uh, Mario's nod right there was funny. Like a tired nod. First the princess and now this. This is just too much to bear. Mario. How about we ask my grandpa for help? He knows everything. Oh, he's omniscient. Excuse me, but who are you? Oh, hello. My name is Mel. I'm from Tadpole Pond. Well, any friend of Mario's is welcome here in Mushroom Kingdom. As I was saying, Mario, you are our only hope. Please, you must rescue the princess. Now! Jeez, so demanding. Mario, I'm in your debt too. Let's head over to Grandpa's place in Tadpole Pond. He can help. Wait. Why did I even come to Mushroom Kingdom in the first place? I guess I'll find out soon enough. Wow, oh, Mel has such terrible memory. Wow. But Mac, the sword like monster who crashed into Mushroom Kingdom, have anything to do with the star piece that Mario found? Our heroes move on to Kettle Sewers. Alright. Let's see. Oh my god, he just says the same thing. Alright, we'll head over to Kettle Sewers later on. Going to go ahead and end this episode right here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and hope you guys, are, uh, some of you guys are willing to give this game a try too. Uh, you can play it on the Super Nintendo Classic, and uh, there are other ways you guys can figure out how to play this game. Anyways, hope you guys take care, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye, everyone. <laughs>